The activities for this year's Armed Forces Remembrance Day and appeal for funds has, have commenced in Benue State with an interdenominational church service organized by the Benue State Chapter of the Christian Association of Nigeria in conjunction with the state government. The service, which was held at the Cherubim and Seraphim Church Movement in Makredi, was dominated by prayers for those who fought for Nigeria's individuals for Nigeria's independence, divine protection over members of the armed forces and other paramilitary, and the families of the ex-servicemen, among others. Our correspondent Francis Ter reports that the Benue State Governor Samuel Otom acknowledged the contributions of the armed forces in sacrificing their lives for the peace of the nation. He was represented by the State Deputy Governor Engineer Benson Abono. that the armed forces have been doing in this nation. And therefore, to thank you, for all those of you who are alive, and to extend that thanks and gratitude to those, for, to those of you who have put down their lives and are now in the great beyond. I want to thank you and thank you from the bottom of my heart. What you have done for this nation cannot be measured. For in Nigeria today, the only institution that I dare and I make bold to say still has a semblance of equity, fairness and justice is the armed forces. In his remark, the Benue State Can Chairman, Reverend Dr. Ampen Liva, enjoined Nigerians to pray for the forthcoming general elections in the country. For successful elections, not only successful, peaceful elections, God is on the throne. I also implore you to pray for the Benue State. Pray for our government. There has been the voice for the voiceless. And through him, God is doing marvelous things in this nation. I'm happy to say that he has a dependable deputy who is fearless, who speaks on behalf of the state. Sir, I salute you.